rules. We, we, do. we, we have you have to decorate the bus. I don't know, like things like maybe this piece of tape, dirty tape on Haley's dirty, hairy tape on Haley's shoe. Oh. It goes here. <laughs> yeah, you have to decorate the bus well. And oh things like what? I mean, you know, like we have the guitar around in case you feel like playing some Jamming tapes. out. We we did have um a puppy poster hanging back here, but it fell because we didn't have any real tape. We just had like that tacky, putty stuff. We just but had hairy, gross tape. Yeah, maybe now that we have some tape, we can put the puppy <laughs> poster back. But um, th I mean, we don't really have legitimate bus rules. It's just that we want when people come on our bus to feel good about themselves and to love themselves and to treat themselves well. So as long as you come on our bus and you just have a good time, then who really cares? Yeah, and there's no breaking the rules. I couldn't go on a tour without my laptop, and it's not because I'm on Facebook or even because of Twitter, because even though I don't have Facebook, but even though I love Twitter, I really, really enjoy blogging, and I follow a lot of other people's blogs that just post really creative and artsy photos or like, you know, like, um, fashion blogs or vintage blogs. I follow a lot of stuff that to me is visually inspiring where it's it's really easy for me to find um, inspiration from other bands like musically, but it's it's cool now that I have an outlet and a way to like to see things that really inspire me other than just like reading a book or it's it's all there on my blog, so I have to have that. That was my number one as well. One thing that I can't live without is the air conditioning of <laughs> Let me tell you, there is no such thing. You don't need air conditioning ever, first of all, but especially not on a tour bus. My second thing is definitely not air conditioning, but it might be blankets. <laughs> I must have a blanket with me. We really wanted to make video for Careful because it's one of it's it's one of our like collectively as a band we love that song. We loved recording it, we loved writing it, we loved playing it live, and we kind of thought it would be awesome to put it out virally and just have something um, that people could, you know, put with it, you know, visually. So we basically got our friend Brandon Chesbro at Brand Chesbro on Twitter. If you, if you care. Um, we had him just sort of compile a ton of live footage along with behind the scenes stuff and hangout videos just from the road. Um, which to me is so important because I mean we can make as many music videos as we wanted to, but like to be able to have something that really shows our life and shows people that don't get a chance to come to the show like what it looks like, um, it's really cool to me. I love watching bands live videos, so this was our chance to make one to one of our heavier, more upbeat songs. And um, like I said, Brandon, who filmed this, he also did our only exception video, which was the first video he ever directed. Um, he, you know, once again. Hit the nail on the head with careful. 